Now another update, this is where we're up to at the moment. We've got the variable frequency drive hooked up to the uh, ozone tubes in the middle of this thing. We've got a neodymium chunk on the tungsten boat. Uh, we've got the vacuum pump there going away as you can hear it. It's pulling the vacuum inside the chamber. Um, I'm going to turn on that thing. As you can see there, the oh, oh. <laughs> shit! Good thing it was on the transformer. There's the sweet spot. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we've got the ozone tubes going. Yeah, <laughs> like the very like they're glowing from the RF. Yeah. yeah. You, you can see there the the, the um, neon bulbs are glowing from the RF from the ozone tubes. Um, plug the variac in, turn it on. You can see the vapor forming. Yeah, the vapors. The vapors just going straight off the bottom. Um, it's hard to see on the phone because it's widening out, but the vapor is going straight downhill. If we turn the ozone machine off... Same thing still. Uh, same thing still, yeah. Didn't change this time. But before the vapor was rising to the top... Yeah. Um, the, the tubes aren't going. You wouldn't see it with all that going on. Oh yeah, they are. Yeah, so yeah. Now, yeah. you can see that through the haze in there that there actually is a bit of a vapour build up. Um, we'll turn everything back off. Turn this back off so I don't shock myself again. You can see now that there's a, a white deposit on the on this end of the vacuum chamber. You can see it there. Uh, also on the stainless protector shield on the bottom for the ozone um, tubes, you can see there's a white deposit there and there's a white deposit there on that protector there. So. It looks like we are getting uh, neodymium uh, vapour. It is depositing on the side of the uh, vacuum chamber. I'll just turn the vacuum pump off. It's whistling. Oh, it's the high voltage. Press that button. Yeah, so there's that vapor again, it's adhered to the side of the vacuum chamber wall. So there you have it, so far so good. We're, I think, we're making neo uh, vapor. Next thing is to pump the argon through the pre ionizer and then through the plastic tab at the end there. into the into the chamber itself so that's the next step so well post your comments and uh, we'll do another update soon bye